I greet you in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. My name is Apostle Idemudia Gobadia. You can call me ID for short. I am the Senior Pastor of Overcomers in Christ Group of Churches. I'm located in Brooklyn, New York, Newark, New Jersey, and currently in Bristol, Pennsylvania. I want to talk to you today about victory over evil dreams. There are some of us, we have a pattern in our dreams. We dream about a similar thing most of the time. It's like an evil pattern in the dream. And tonight, in the name of Jesus, we are going to believe God for your deliverance. Some of you, when you have a dream, it opens the door for a misfortune the next day or the next couple of days. We are going to pray to God for deliverance in the name of Jesus. Usually, people that have that kind of dream, that is an indication that there is an evil covenant. There is an evil covenant somewhere that gives the enemy access to harass you. Tonight, we are going to pray that you will have victory over every demonic affliction in the dream in the mighty name of Jesus. I want to encourage you to repent of every sin. If there be any sin in your life, any unforgiveness, this will be the time to let it go so that the power of God can flow freely into your life and so that you can receive the victory. Let us pray. Father, I lift up the one hearing the sound of my voice right now in the name of the Lord Jesus. Every sin that they have committed, as they repent tonight, Lord, forgive them. I want you to say after me, Heavenly Father, in the name of Jesus, I confess that I am a sinner and I repent of all my sins. Lord, forgive me of my sins and give me the grace to walk in righteousness. I ask this in Jesus' name as I forgive all that have sinned against me. Amen. Now we're going to pray over those dreams. Let me pray for you first. Father, in the name of Jesus, every strong man assigned against this one, every open gate in this one's life that gives the enemy access into their life to afflict them in the dream. That when they dream, they see serpents. They are being fed all manner of poison in the dream because a gate is open. Father, today, in the name of Jesus, as you have given us authority to possess the gates of our enemies, Father, I possess every enemy gate and I bind every demonic gatekeeper at our gates. I command that strong man to be bound in the name of Jesus. Every devilish power feeding you in the dream, every devilish power appearing as a demonic animal in the dream, every devilish power harassing you in the dream, today I shut the gates against them. I forbid them from making an entry into your life in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. We shut the gate against the enemy. In the name of Jesus, I forbid them from making an entry. I forbid them from making an appearance in your life. In the name of Jesus Christ, I cover you in the blood of Jesus. The Lord sent holy angels to encamp around you. Just as the mountains surround Jerusalem, so shall the Lord surround you right now in the name of Jesus. I plead the blood of Jesus over you. In Jesus' name, Amen. I bind all spirits of witchcraft in the name of Jesus Christ. I bind all occult spirits that are working against you. All ancestral spirits that have access into your life. I bind them in the name of Jesus Christ. That evil pattern in your dream. That dream that follows an evil pattern all the time. Today in the name of Jesus. I reverse all satanic dreams. I reverse it in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. By the covenant power in the blood of Jesus Christ. I revoke every evil covenant that, that you are a party to. I revoke that covenant now in the name of Jesus. You begin to revoke it as well. Begin to revoke it as well. Say, Lord, any ancestral covenant. Say after me, Lord, any ancestral covenant 
that ties me, that connects me to a demonic strong man. Today, in the name of Jesus, I break and I destroy that covenant in the mighty name of Jesus. I release myself from every evil covenant and every evil soul tie that gives satanic powers access into my life in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Now that you pray that simple prayer, just believe in faith and continue to pray it consistently. Your breakthrough is imminent. Your deliverance is imminent. You're going to pray. Please say after me. I plead the blood of Jesus Christ over my body, soul, and spirit. And I shut the gates to my soul from every evil power in the name of Jesus Christ. Blood of Jesus Christ, sanctify me body, soul, and spirit. Sanctify my mind. Lord, sanctify me by the washing of the word. Purify my mind and my thoughts that when I sleep, my thoughts will not feed my dream life. That contrary thoughts will not feed my dream life in the name of Jesus. In Jesus' name, Amen. We are still going to pray against evil dream. Every evil dream you've had in the name of Jesus Christ, I forbid that dream from coming into manifestation. I abort that dream now in the name of Jesus. I abort it in the name of Jesus and I forbid it from having life. Every satanic work done against you in the dream, let it be reversed and destroyed now in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. I command every evil arrow shot at you in the dream to backfire in the name of Jesus. Where you were defeated in the dream, Tonight, in the name of Jesus, let that defeat be reversed. Let that defeat be reversed. Let that defeat be reversed in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Everything you lost in the dream, every good virtue that was stolen from you in the dream, recover it back now. Recover it back. Recover it back in the name of Jesus Christ. I declare that you are victorious in Jesus' name. I declare that you are victorious in Jesus' name. No weapon fashioned against you shall prosper. Every evil that appears to you in the night, in the dream, they will appear no more in Jesus' name. That curse is broken. That tie is broken. Every tie between you and an evil spirit that gives that evil spirit the right to afflict you, that soul tie is broken now in the name of Jesus. Father, I thank you. Lord, perfect this one's deliverance. I ask in Jesus' name. God bless you. We are praying that the Lord will lift you up out of the miry clay. We are praying for God's peace and salvation to rest upon you. I am Idemudia Gobadia, Overcomers in Christ Group of Churches. We meet every Friday at 7 p.m. at 557 Rogers Avenue. In Brooklyn, New York. We meet also on Sundays at 11 a.m. at 557 Rogers Avenue in Brooklyn, New York. See you. God bless you.